Hi everyone, it's Waxfraud here, and welcome back to episode 6 of the Minecraft Hardcore Let's Play series. Uh, we're on 1.17.1 right now, and dude, this is fun. I uh, actually, on live on Twitch, uh, actually yesterday, this, we built this, this nice little fishing dock. Nice little upgrade compared to what I did on the last Let's Play, but I like this. I like the design. It's kind of a Viking esque design i guess uh but we also have a little bit of a park looking area oh yeah actually i totally forgot need to put these cobblestone stairs in let's get that done uh but yeah we did this on live on twitch if you want to catch me on twitch it is wax fraud on twitch and uh, all the other links to basically all the other socials are just down below in the description like uh twitter instagram anything like that if you want to catch me basically anywhere if you want to uh, support me on patreon if you want to join the discord that's down below as well but yeah pop in over here get another look at the Doc, look at that. I like it. It looks pretty nice. Actually, at the top, I might, I should, I should probably add, I need to add some spruce trap doors. Just realized that right now. It is a little bit different, though, because last time we never had these hedges right here. Uh, we never had, oh my god, I can't believe I, I forgot I used the hedges last time to get up there. Do I have any more? I guess not. Let's just use the gravel to get up there right now. We got some fixing to do. There we go. Let's prop ourselves up here nice and easy. There we go. Mm-hmm. There we go. Where's the trapdoors? Right there. But yeah, the main thing I actually wanted to get done today was um, a turtle sanctuary. Because we had a bunch of turtles. Oh, look, there's two right there, actually. Um, there's a bunch out there. Oh, there's one right there. But there's a bunch, like, over in that area. I kind of want to bring some over here. I'm going to get rid of this tree farm. I just need a bunch of spruce wood for this build, probably. Maybe not, though. I might use amethyst. Um, or maybe some copper. Maybe some copper. I may, I'm going to use a lot of glass, though. So I'm going to have to get a bunch of sand either from here over from the desert so yeah definitely gonna have to do that i think i'm gonna actually hop down here as well i don't know why i didn't use my shovel i'm really bad at that people call me out in the comments all the time as well i always see that down there never be using the shovel when i need to nice got some trap doors right there so that's looking decent as well we can even just kind of prop it up for just extra detail up in here yeah that looks great i love that Ooh, wait looks like i found an imperfection right there there we go gotta get that out put that right there get that right there and we call it good that is that's looking nice perfect let's go to the bed i have some materials that i need to gather actually before i do anything before i forget to do anything i need to uh get over here and actually just do this because i i've been doing this on my other builds putting a lantern right there um just right at the top because i'll take a step back it makes it a little bit more viking-esque like i was talking about earlier but do that dude that is amazing that adds so much to the build that makes it a little bit more 3d so i need to do that to every edge and uh, definitely make that look nice i also need to feed the sheep here real quick i need to try to get myself up to level 30 i'd like to Try to at least enchant something else, like a tool, or... Oh, I guess that's... Is that all that I got? I think I used it all. Oh, hopefully I can get enough XP right here. Come on now, sheep. Little bit of XP. Don't make me have to do it. If I have to swipe... Uh, I'm gonna have to literally swipe at a sheep for XP. Come on. Oh, man. Didn't mean to do it. I didn't want... Sorry, buddy. Sorry, buddy. Well, we're at level 30. I'd like to try to get something nice down here. I don't know exactly what I would want to make, though. Let's see. Some lapis... What do I need to take out? I have everything enchanted except for my pants, I guess. We got unbreaking. We could get a book here, too. What I should do is go grab some books. I can't believe I didn't think of that yet. Time to grab some books. And popping back down. Let's take a look. What do we got for the pants? Unbreaking 3, I guess. We might end up getting, like, protection with it or something. But it's worth taking a look at the book. Knock back to Aqua Affinity. What do I have on this? protection respiration i could actually use aqua affinity on that book like right now it is going to take through two levels i think yeah it will and then how many will it take to get because i'm gonna have to get i need to go to the anvil now and let's upgrade this baby right here there we go let's put some book on that bam and it only costs two actually not bad at all perfect let's put that back on and now we can swim underwater forever Okay, so before we get anything... Actually, what are you selling, man? Let me just check. I know I, I'm not going to buy anything, but... Okay, sorry, I didn't mean to do that, sir. There we go. What do you got for me? Nothing of an... Ooh, blue orchids is... I don't think I have that flower over here yet. And if I do, then I lost it. I need to find that swamp biome. Those were... That's where those are at. But I do need to go over here. Yeah, I'm, I'm about to just get rid of these spruce trees, get myself a couple stacks of them. I don't even know if I'm going to use the wood on the build, but I'm going to get rid of this tree farm real quick. 
also going to use the top real quick to just to navigate where I want this turtle sanctuary to go. I know I just want to build something for the turtles. Honestly, might just do it like right there in this area where the turtles are already hanging out. That might make it easier because I am going to start expanding everything over there and that might make it easier. Actually, that is most likely what I'm going to do. Yeah, once I'm done swooping up all of these little logs, though, too, I'm going to have to go get, like, literally just clear that desert of all of its sand, basically. I'm going to have to start getting a bunch of resources, actually. I could actually probably do a, a live stream of getting the resources as well. That might be not a bad idea. And now we're off to get as much sand as we possibly can beyond that savanna to the desert. Just start hacking away as soon as we find a place that we want to hack away at. I'm thinking maybe right here looks good. Let's do it. Let's just get a couple of stacks, maybe like maybe five, six stacks, and oh, it's about to be about to be sleepy time. Yeah, about five or six stacks. Then we'll head back and probably fill up because that I see there there was a big hole back there. You may have noticed, and I have to fill that up real quick. So that's gonna take at least two stacks. Maybe I'll get like maybe I'll get six or seven, seven or eight. I'll figure it out. All right, so we have ten stacks. Definitely ten stacks is enough. So. I say let's get out of here and uh, yeah, let's go start building or at least see what we can start building with. I, I don't even know if we have enough copper and if we don't, then that's an issue. But um, I have a design in my head. I want to kind of get it started here and see what we can do and just see what we can get it to look like. But ooh, hello town. I see. I see what you start to look like from here. Dang, that dock looks pretty cool from back here. It's also crazy how Minecraft does this, where there's just a wall. It looks like just an infinity pool. There's just a wall of glass here. It's so cool, especially with the shaders. You're just like, what is happening here? I wonder what it looks like underwater. Not really anything, but from this side, even when you go through it, it doesn't break, but it looks kind of sick right here without the glass. This is pretty cool, honestly. Get all the glass smelting here, basically just as much as we can. And, uh, ooh, looks like we already have a little bit in there. Uh, that's it for now. Actually, we have a bunch more on this side that we can start smelting as soon as we get more coal up in here. But I have more coal down in the basement, and by the basement I mean the bedrock. Um, but, let's see how much copper we actually have. Oh, you know what? Significant amount. Significant amount. Let's see. How do you make the blocks? You just do this, or you just do this. Copper blocks, my goodness. That is quite a few. No wonder that generates so often. You kind of need a lot to be making the, the blocks, you know, but... Yeah, let's see how many blocks we can make. Let's take a look here. Ooh, we can make exactly 38 blocks of copper, so that's not that much in comparison to how much glass we have. Okay, and it's nighttime, and I completely forgot that uh, mobs are spawning right now. Let's get out of here. Can I just take a sleep right there? I'm taking a sleep right here. I really gotta be more careful of that, but, uh, but yeah, I gotta finish taking that last tree down, and then let's get this glass smelted here, and then, yeah, let's start building. So what I actually need to do first is come back down here and kind of just start filling all this stuff in again. And uh, yeah, then I'll have more of an area to be able to uh, actually work with. And I kind of want to do like a big, almost like a greenhouse design, but it's going to be like just a, just a sanctuary for the turtles to be hanging out. Damn, these dolphins really seem to like the new dock too. They're just chilling, stuck in zero motion. This turtle really wants to get fed also, but we did get this. Oh, there's a bunch of trolls up here now. What's up, turtles? I didn't think there was as many. Got you right there. Figured, you know what? Let's start making some baby turtles right here, right now. Because it's, I mean, gotta start bringing them sooner than later. Because, um, I don't know, if we're making a turtle sanctuary, we're gonna want more turtles around here. And we're gonna want a bunch of turtles that call this beach home. And so, um, I mean, hopefully that they're, hopefully they just chill up here and make this the beach to go to. I'm not sure exactly where they're gonna be swimming off to, to put the eggs, but hopefully it's around this area. I'm not really sure where they're going. They're uh, they're actually just going into nowhere. What are you guys doing? Ah, uh, okay, now I get it, my dude. Now I see what you're doing. I guess they were just trying to go over to this little pond. Um, I guess, never mind, he stopped? What's going, ah, uh, there we go. I guess one's doing it. What is happening? Where is this guy going? Does he have, he had a destination, dude. A de There's no sand in this direction, though. What are you doing? Well, this is pretty silly to watch. Oh my God, dude, you're making a mess. You're making a big mess, my dude. Oh my god, this is crazy. <laughs> Jeez, my dude, you're making a mess. Would you look at it? How many do we got? We got one. We got one. That's what I'm talking about, though. Now this dude is literally, he's stuck over here. I have to help him out because he's a, he's a ding-dong. What are you doing, my dude? Let's get out of there. There you go. You ding-dong. Where's he going at now? 
Where could you possibly be moving at two miles per hour? I am actually going to silk touch this egg. Uh, let's do silk touch right here. Wait. Yeah, silk touch. Because... And bam. Sorry, that was just a crazy noise. Just a smashing noise. Um, I kind of, yeah, because I want the turtle to be born in this area, you know? So, actually, just for right now, I'll have this specific turtle just born right there. And uh, then we can get to work on the actual build itself. I do and I didn't. Of course I didn't. I do want to use, actually, I decided, because I was going to use a little bit of copper, but I decided I'm going to use uh, mainly spruce. Because earlier I was like, I'm not using any spruce. But you know what? I think I am going to use spruce now. And then if I can incorporate copper, then I will. But if I can't, then I'm going to do it on a different build. But if we're going to do some sort of uh, greenhouse look with all the spruce wood that we just chopped up. And while this turtle is trying to, like, just struggling to figure out what literally anything is, I'm actually just going to go over here to all of these turtles and make a couple more. Baby turtles, here we come. We got one. Oh, did I do it? Wait a second. We got one in you. We got two. Wait, there, wait, there we go. There we go. There we go. Yeah, let's, let's, break, let's get the baby turtles going, man. Oh my god, and this one finally literally just traveled so far to come over here and just literally on the edge of nothing i don't know why you did that but you got two in there my dude thank you for that i'll take these babies right here from you now i got four total because i got three with me here and the one that i already put back there so is this are you about to lay your eggs or not man choose choose a spot actually you know what four for now is fine and uh, we'll actually have some turtles that'll be born in this area because turtles actually are they always hang out at the beach that they're born near and they always um breed at the beach that they're born at i believe i think that's the rule for turtles um, that's just like their AI rules, but, uh, there's kind of a lot of dirt in this area and some sand up in here that I really need to get rid of. What's up, my dude just chilling down here, he likes that. But yeah, there's actually, there's quite a few things that I need to get, like, rid of. And actually, what I'll do is just this. Get, let's get three of them right there. That way, they can just be born here, and they'll be chilling up all over, even up next to the dock. I do want to start off with something simple, but I want to, like, bring it out into the water so that part of the build is literally just out in here. Like, maybe like this all the way down here because that, that's the part that's going to make it interesting a little bit more unique and then i might just go like five in between like one two three four five and we'll go like that and we'll go all the way up and now we got like the pole structure around here for the house that i want to get done done and uh now we can start thinking about what is going to go where i think i want to well, we need to get a crafting table here of course that's perfect right there we'll get a, just a little crafting table a little crafting station right here and uh what we're gonna have to do is probably yeah get a bunch of these make a bunch of spruce stairs as well probably oh, we already got a bunch of trap doors more stairs please and uh now that we got these yeah we'll probably have to just i don't know let's uh let's see exactly what needs to be done because we know i know that there's gonna have to be places where we put lanterns like this like i don't even know if the lantern's gonna go here but uh probably will probably will end up doing that and you know what let's just let's experiment a little bit so I was working on the roof, and we found ourselves some trouble. So I don't know, um, do I like get, get out of here? Because there's fight, nah. We could try fighting them real quick. This is going to be a little bit of a shenanigan time here, because they're all going to try to start shooting. I want to maybe try to get them to start shooting each other. That might be, that might be kind of nice. What's up, guys? Haha, <laughs> they are shooting each other. Literally just running back and forth like this is just easy enough. That they will literally not hit you. Okay, I spoke way too soon. You just hear the owls. They're like, ow, ow. They all just keep hitting each other. Look at that, you guys. What are you doing? I'm trying not even to hit them with the damage. Like, they're inflicting their own damage. Except for this. Yeah, gun. Yeah, gun. Yeah, gun. You got taken. Look at that. Literally, that was like my first swipe at a lot of them. You yeah, done. You gonna hit me, sir? You yeah, done. Well, that's always fun. And I guess we have another banner to put up in the house over here, so... Let's do that real quick. A little bit of decoration. Ooh, look at this right there. Love it. Love it. But yeah, after that little nonsense, it's starting to it's starting to take shape a little bit. Just a little bit of shape. Like, you can see where the entrance is going to be and where the top parts are going to be. But I'm still trying to figure out the shape of the roof because I have to fit the glass in there too. And speaking of that, I might as well just start grabbing the glass and kind of start building with it. I do have silk touch now, so if I make any mistakes, I can just re-grab it from there. Yeah, so I'm starting to struggle a little bit on exactly where, what's up dolphin, exactly where to put the glass going up here for this turtle sanctuary. It's kind of just trying not to be an extremely large greenhouse design, but yeah, you know what, I'll actually, I'll show you. Let's jump down here. That would, ooh, if I didn't have feather fallen and I landed on the ground, 
That would not be good. That reminds me, I need to get feather falling on here. But yeah, let's actually get a little bit further up this way. What's up, turtle? How you doing? Um, yeah, I mean, this is what it's looking like right now. You can go through with your boat right there. And on the other side, there is a door that we put in, but... It seems to be looking good right now. I'm just putting in the edges of the roof and the glass in at the moment, but I, I'm just trying to figure out exactly if that's how I want it to go up. I'm not sure if I want to make any changes to this. We'll just have to keep working on it. Dude, we are just about done with the skeletal structure here. Just basically the glass, the the bones of the structure. Um, I think we have, yeah, just this little line here of glass we have to do. One, two, th up three, and then that guy. And we should be done. Once I'm done with this, though, I'm going to take a step back and see how we did. See if we need to add any extra details. And then I need to grab a bunch of lanterns. A bunch of lanterns. All right, popping away here. And I did make a small little tree farm right here because I did run out of spruce. Ran out of spruce. Ooh, this egg is cracking, dude. This egg is cracking right now. That's actually pretty cool. Um, but let's take a look. This doesn't look too bad. I actually am digging this. I put the things at the top. I might make some flags. I've never... Uh, Never made flags before, so I would have to kind of figure out how to do that. I might make, like, flags out of geode. That'd be kind of cool, like, or, like, amethyst flags. Or some white flags with some amethyst on it. I'm not, I'm really not sure. But I do need to hang some more lanterns and do some more texture on the side. I did, let's see here. Yeah, I did go through and start stripping some of these logs, as you can tell here. I think that's what I'm going to end up doing to basically all of them. Basically the whole bill. I, I, feel, I feel like this makes it look a little bit more beachy you know this is a more beach vibe with everything stripped also something we need to do like just so the turtles uh can get in and out easily um, i'm gonna get rid of all of the dirt right here i'll probably like put the logs going a little bit down lower right there but uh yeah i'm gonna have to get it so the uh, there's there's some zombies down here man i can i can hear them for sure but yeah, I want the turtles to be able to get in and out of here easily. I'm just putting a glass barrier here so that, like, mobs... I guess, I don't know what mobs wouldn't be able to just go right under. Hmm. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Really, I'm just... This is mainly for the purples. The, for the, the the purple, wow. The turtles, I mean... Nothing really is going to be spawning over here anyways except for the turtles. Because I'm going to put a bunch of sea pickles and a bunch of stuff on the sea floor down here. And uh, it's going to make it so nothing spawns um, in the dark down here. It'll be nice. Because I am going to make this go a little bit deeper, as you can see, like right here. And uh, yeah, then we'll be able to make it just, you know, just do that. You know, it's not that bad. So I finally got all the hedges up here. And uh, it's starting to look nice. I actually started to put some of the leaves up top here as well. Get all the trap doors around the sides. Got the buttons and the signs there, as well as the hanging lanterns. Everything's starting to look good. In my opinion, I guess. Um, yeah, and then actually, if you jump down here, this is... I actually just cleared this out. If you notice, I, oh, I actually need to... Looks like I have to fix that as well. Let's get that in there. And then, oops, that's that's an accident. Let's get that done as well. And bop. Okay, so, right, bop right there. Per okay, perfect. So, got that done. And then, yeah, actually, down here is what I was talking about just a little bit ago about how I wanted to get this... Kind of just, like, just bring it down more because I want to make a nicer, I don't know, just an area for all the turtles to roam around once they all hatch. And, uh, yeah, as you can see, we actually just did a live stream on Twitch. I literally just did it a little, like, not just ended, like, maybe a half hour ago. I just ate, like, I just ate some ramen, and then I hopped right back in here to record the rest of this. Oh, we got turtles everywhere over here now. Dang. Yeah, we have turtle eggs popping up all over because I've just been breeding them like crazy. Like, if you look in here, bam, we got rows of turtle eggs. And they're also on the other side as well, like, all the way back there. But yeah, you can see if you actually run back over here that... Oh, what's up, turtle? I'll help you out. Get on in there. Get in there. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, but yeah, if you run back over here, it used to be, like, right up against the edge. But now you can just run right in here, and the turtles have a bunch of space. Like, this guy just went under. Now you can go in and out. And I actually also added... as you, Oh my god, I don't want to break any of these. I actually added a bunch of composters inside here as well, just to kind of hedge it up. And I put some hedges up there, and I think it just... Made it look a little bit nicer. I do want to kind of maybe put some signs, spruce trap doors, some buttons maybe all along the inside here. Because that's something that I didn't do. But it definitely would help um, like make the, the build look a little bit more thick. I also am planting a tree right here as well. That's why I got the two bricks. Because I want it to be a large tree. Uh, I just want the turtles to have like a, a good environment in here. But yeah, I wanted to take a look at it. I really haven't really gotten a good look at it over this way yet. So let's actually just take a swim this way. And actually, I should. I kind of want to bring, because I took down a lot of that. I want to bring it more this way. 
Um, probably maybe go down like one or two more as well. Cause I want to bring in like some, I want to make my own coral reef down here. I think that'd be super cool. Might do my own episode about doing my own like, ap like actual coral reef. I think that'd be dope. Um, but then uh, maybe bring it more this way as well. Cause I like being able to jump in and swim rather than like this part right here. where you have to slowly like either float or jump on the water. Aha. Looking good though. I love this dude. This is sick. This is absolutely sick. And I got some... I made that a little bit, look a little bit more intricate than it did on the other side, but... Oh my god. I like this a lot. And I kind of... I still want to do the flag with the amethyst. Maybe... Like, maybe you copper flag as well. We'll still... I'll try to figure that out. But dude, this is... This is looking pretty good right now. All I need is all those turtles to start hatching, and then we're good to go. I might have one go over here, too. It does look like, though, right... See, because I got the hedges up there and over here. I kind of I kinda need to put some hedges. Do I have some left? I got 37 left. That's plenty. I kind of need to put some over here. And then, uh, yeah. Actually, you know what? Let's do that right now. Just going to have to run over in this direction. And, yeah, actually, that makes a lot... Yeah, I didn't put anything down here. Now to another thing about it. Let's actually just go this way. Maybe right... Nah. And eh, that's fine, I guess. We'll just go this way, like this. Not really much else to do. I'll probably put one right there. Maybe we'll put another one, like, going out like this. Just kind of hanging off the edge. Going up like that one. We'll go right there, maybe. Just two. Uh, maybe we'll go like this and have it hang out back. Eh, that, look, that looks alright. If I fall, can I... Ah, I missed. I thought I was going to be able to do it, but I can just do it from right here. I like how it hangs. We can do one over here that hangs too. Let's just do that right there, that right there. That way it hangs down a little bit. I like that. That's nice. Luckily, I have this uh, efficiency three, I believe. It's efficiency three, but it, yeah, only efficiency three. Imagine efficiency five. I honestly don't have that yet, but dude, efficiency five. Efficien dude, efficiency three is working so well right now. I, can't, I don't even, I can't even imagine efficiency five right now. But, dude, yeah, I'm just clearing this out a little bit lower because I feel like the coral reef needs just a little bit more space for the coral to be a little bit higher. But, yeah, I figured, you know what, I'm just going to spend the time uh, making this right now just a little bit deeper, you know. I'll, I'll end up getting the spruce down here just to meet it, and uh, we'll see what happens. But I think right here is getting as deep as it should. I'll probably make it over here a little bit deeper as well. All right, so I need to run back out real quick. Let's grab this boat right here, and I actually need to... Uh, Go back to basically to the coral reef area that I saw over here. And uh, I'm actually probably just going to run through this area over here. I'm just going to need to go to the coral reef area and grab as much. I just need to get, I want I want to like spice up the place, you know, with some color. Grab some coral, a lot more sea pickles. Probably get some sea grass. And uh, probably end up bone mealing a bunch too. But yeah, I mean, here we go. Uh, let's just grab a bunch of stuff. Oh my god, there's, all, there's a bee all the way out here. That's, I mean, all the bees keep disappearing. Here's one. Why am I swimming like that? All the bees keep disappearing, and uh, here's one of them. They just keep on, uh, they keep on escaping, and they, I don't even know what you're doing out here, buddy. Ooh, here's what we need to do. Let's grab some kelp. I haven't done any of that yet. Let's just, let's get down here to the bottom. Let's just, let's just get some kelp, dude. A bunch of it. And I'd say that a couple stacks is probably enough of kelp. Um, I think we're a little bit, not that far actually, but I, what I do want to do, I want to get some axolotls out here too. Um, I think it'd be cool to have some that are just like chilling out in the, uh, in the open water by me. Okay, so it's like nighttime, and you can see my boat up there still, but I like hit this weird spot under the water where, dude, look at that over there. This is crazy. I'm taking a picture of this real quick. This is weird. Yeah, this is definitely super weird. What is going on? But yeah, I hit this air pocket where I'm in this bed. I'm just sleeping underwater right now. It's kind of cool, actually. I don't know. I never knew that you could do this. I just like real. I just I just put the trap doors like right there, and I don't even know if you needed to do that. But yeah, it is the way it is. It allowed me to not have to go back home real quick to uh, to sleep. I'm actually, gonna come back in and use the boat in the way that I wanted it. Ah, oh, mini tree. No. Oh, what's up, turtle? Using the turtle sanctuary as intended. I'm actually just gonna. Park the boat up over here, away from the actual turtles. But dude, this, uh, do the brakes not work? I actually was, I was trying to get a big tree, but it didn't work at all. Anyways, what I really should do, just to kind of get decorating down here, because, I mean, if you go back up here, dude, I, even during, like, after, like, an almost three-hour stream, all of these turtle shells are still going, dude. They take so long, like, so long to hatch. Oh, we had one hatch over here, though. There should, if we, oh, what's up, my dude? 
How you doing? What do you got to sell today? Even though I'm not gonna buy anything, I already got a, I already got a stack of bubble coral, my dude. I don't need that. But yeah, I'm gonna hop back in. I kind of want to start placing some kelp around. We gotta like just start, you know, just kind of fancying up the place. But uh, but yeah, we'll just get some of this around here. Actually, there is some iron. I should actually. Where's this? What's that? Silk touch. What's this? Fortune three. Yeah, let's go back down. We need to get some fortune three on this iron real quick before we do anything. All right, and it's looking good. We just need to go around, probably just place, yeah, just place a bunch of these, uh, oh no. Forgot about that. We're gonna have to do this. We can actually, actually, now that we have that kelp in there, we can do that. That's actually kind of nice. Very convenient. Thank you, kelp. Because that kind of turns it into a water source. But around these, I would like to actually just go ahead and bone meal. Bone meal it up, get all that looking nice down here. I think that makes everything look super nice. Um, we can do this, one, two, three, four. Yeah, honestly, we'll just have to take some of the spot of the kelp, and then we'll go through and place that kelp down again. But yeah, I actually am starting to like the way that a lot of this is starting to look. So it's looking decent so far. We have our own little, uh, area that, I mean, like, it's just, it's a nice area to swim around. All the turtles are just, oh, I, I need to get some spruce wood to replace these pillars down, because we're going down a lot lower now. But, you know, let's, uh, I mean, we can start to kind of just... Color this up. Let's do it. I mean, we can just kind of start forming a tree. We don't have too much at the moment, but we have enough to where we can start kind of making some coral trees. So actually, I got a little creative, and instead of uh, putting the spruce down back to the bottom, I actually just put the coral up to the spruce to kind of make it look like the the dock is going into the coral here. So I figured, you know, that's kind of a, that's not bad. That's not too bad. There is constant water flow down here. It's kind of crazy, but... What we need to do is, oh, okay, and I'm losing air, losing air real quick. Let's find um, a couple, because we got some tube corals, fire coral, literally all, like almost every type of coral right here to be able to start putting everywhere. And so once we have this, ooh, and some kelp left. Once we have that down, we have quite a bit of stuff to start placing, you know. We can put some more kelp over here and over here and over there. And then this is where it starts getting colorful. We got all of this stuff right here, dude. This is amazing. I love this. Well, my dude ended up getting caught in a boat. This is, uh, this is not good, dude. This is not good at all. I really, really hope that we can get you out of there. A-OK. -okay. I am gonna try my best to not hit you because you take up the entirety of the- Oh, we got it. Okay. Whew. That was close, my dude. Don't be doing that. Dude, these guys are literally back here again for a vengeance. Or they're back here for revenge or, or something like that, but, uh, you're not gonna get it, my dude. Sorry about it. You're done. Oh boy, they just didn't stand a chance. I'm sorry about it, my dude. And I, you know what? Can you stop that? Thank you very much. That's very nice of you. He gave me a crossbow with, uh, uh, I'm breaking one. That is it. I'm breaking one. That's fine. Okay. Uh, well, I mean, that was a nice little distraction for a brief moment. Let's get the rest of this out. So we have some coral. We have the coral fan, which isn't the best. He left arrows down here. The, uh, dude, if arrows actually stayed, that'd be cool if they, like, just stayed over time and then, like, sometimes disappeared. Um, I think that'd be sick, but, I mean, you can't win them all. And it's looking close to being done. We just kind of got a bone meal, just a couple areas around here to make it seem like a little bit more grassy, like right there, right there, and maybe just right down here. Ooh, that's not what I meant to do. Right down here, though, is what I meant to do. And yeah, you know what? It's like, it starts to look good. We got our own little, uh, we got our own little biome down here, our own little coral reef. I think it looks cool. We're going to add on it to, like, add on to it as time goes on. I was really hoping by now that the uh, the turtles would have hatched, but oh my god, they have not. We have so many turtles that are just waiting to hatch here. I guess what we can do is get the flag up there. Let's try to get those flags up, and then I, mean, I hope we have enough amethyst. Let's try to get those flags up, and then hopefully by the time we are done getting that up, and then maybe just tearing this tree little, little mini tree farm down, uh, the turtle will have hatched. Not entirely sure how to get this to look good. I'm actually just going to go out this way a little bit further. I'm just using those to build up. They sound so good when you do that. I know I'm going to do one on top there, and then it's going to be kind of strange. I kind of want the uh, flag to kind of just be like maybe down here. You know, I'm trying to picture the flag like in a good light here, trying to see if that would even look good. I just, I don't know. I don't know if that looks good or not. Yeah, I think I'm going to end up taking it down. It might just be too much for that build. It might just be too much. Actually, maybe I need to take out that top corner. Maybe that's all I need to do. So I actually have a pretty good idea. I'm going to take all of this out because, I mean, I, I can't do the flag. I, I, I guess I'm just not skilled enough to be able to build one 
that I like. I guess it's up to my standards, but standards, I mean. But I'll do this. Put a lantern at the top of this just to make it, uh, you know, just a little bit more special. I think I might need to hop up here. And let's just go right there. Wait, there we go. Okay, perfect. Dude, these dudes are literally back again. Rolling up with six this time. Six dudes this time. Oh my god. When are they going to learn? They're just chilling by the campfire. They're like, yo, let's take over this camp spot. But yeah, what I actually wanted to do was, yeah, I'm going to ignore those villagers this time, but I wanted to make actually make a, uh, a coral out of the geodes. I figured that actually might look pretty good. It, it has the same kind of coral qualities, and yeah, I mean, look at that. It definitely looks, that looks super good, dude. Oh, that's sick. And then I can, I'm pretty sure we can put coral on it, which we will, but uh, we're just going to scatter that out a little bit. Dude, that's sick. And then we can bring that down like this. Oh my god. That's super sick, dude. I'll even probably put one over here. Dude, this is outstanding. I am super happy about this. All right, and this is basically it, you guys. This is going to be the turtle build. I'm honestly super excited about this. This is a pretty fun one to build, and we, like honestly just re-landscaping anything and just turning it into a coral reef, like just putting, using anything with amethyst. Anything with turtles also is just amazing. But guys, that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. Super, super fun. I guess I'm still waiting for this tree behind me to grow, but that's going to be it for this build. I might uh, mess around with the interior a little bit more as time goes on, but I'm really just too indecisive at the moment. But yeah, that's basically it right now, guys. Um, if you enjoyed this episode, feel free to like and subscribe. Catch me live on Twitch if you want to see anything live. Patreon link and Discord link are down below, as well as the merch link. But yeah, that's actually going to be it. Can't wait till episode 7, but this has been a successful episode 6. This is a really fun build, probably the biggest build that we have in the game so far. I believe, yeah, the biggest build in this world so far. Um, but yeah, it was a success, and uh, yeah, until next time, take care of yourselves, guys. Bye.